What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today, you guys, we have Kelly Price in the click today, you guys. With sadness, she is now missing in Georgia after revealing her COVID battle. I feel really bad because she's such an icon, and I really hope that she will be found soon. But I had to come here and let you guys know that she is definitely missing. Now, I got a clip of her explaining her symptoms and things that was happening at that moment but that's the last time that the world her fans and family has seen her here we go Good evening everybody um i am doing probably one of the last things that i would have expected to be doing right now um wasn't feeling so well last night and got up this morning and went to the doctor and got checked out, went to a testing center, and it has come back that I have COVID after a very long year and a half of so much stuff with this disease. Um, I am COVID positive. And so I am quarantined right now. I do not have to go into the hospital. Um, I'm very achy. I have no appetite. I'm very weak. I can barely stay awake. Um, and so I am following doctor's orders and praying that uh, this thing passes quickly so that I can get back to normal. I just, uh, well, whatever normal is now. Well, there you have it. Shortly after that video, you guys, she ended up getting worse and COVID got the best of her and she had to go into the hospital. There's been reports to say that she was in the ICU. This is crazy. Then they said that she was released. Now, all her family knows she was in the ICU. She wasn't doing too well. And then they released her, even though she wasn't doing well. But they also went out to look for her to do a farewell check. And she was not at her residence, but her boyfriend definitely was at the residence. And they definitely asked some questions and they did their thorough investigation. And they said that there were no foul play done. Now, I don't know, you guys, this sound really weird. It's just not adding up. Like, how has she come from making a video talking about her having COVID, going into the hospital, end up in the ICU, not doing well. And they released her. Like she revealed that she was struggling and then they just released her a week later. And I don't understand how hospitals can release someone if their condition worsened. And then the boyfriend that she is just in love with on social media, she posts him on her page. The family had concern and they believe that the boyfriend was the one who's keeping her away from the family. Something's just not right. How is she released from the hospital? And then she posts a picture like this with a ring. And we're supposed to believe that the boyfriend have nothing to do with this. Then the fact that the family says that he keeps the family and friends from coming into the home. I've been in an abusive relationship before. I know what trolling man looks like and is, okay? So this is really, really, really sketchy and just something that just needs to be taken care of. I don't know, but something better happen. And I pray to God that they find Kelly Price. And I really pray that nothing happened to her. I'm going to keep her in my prayers. And I pray that you guys keep her in your prayers as well. Because I want her to have a safe return home to her family, her friends, and the people who love her the most. I'm praying that this man is not an accessory to this missing case right now because we don't need this until the next time you guys i will see you guys in the next video Epic the dad.